okay so this question compound z c7 h13 br uh, has two chiral centers okay, and after that um, it's uh, undergo reaction uh, with hot ethanolic NaOH so this one uh, the compound z will undergo elimination so it's going to remove the HBr and it's produced three isomers okay this is the key so only three isomers so for this a b c d uh, if it's able to form three isomers okay and the two of these isomers they are opticals isomer to each other which means uh, the one of that is has chiral center okay that why that's why it can form optical isomer okay so um, for a uh, this compound is given the elimination can happen okay from this bromine and this hydrogen Okay, so these two will be removed and it's form this double bond. Okay, then it's form this uh, product. And this product is has one chiral center here. Okay, so um, so it has one hydrogen, okay, one group, okay, one group, another group another group right. okay so therefore this is a chiral carbon and another product is this bromine also can remove with this hydrogen okay so it's form a double bond here so it's form two products and one of the product here this one is has one chiral center that's why this one can form two optical isomers okay, this one is just one only okay, so total is three okay and for B uh, it also has a uh, two chiral center okay this one and this one right okay so it's a uh, meets the requirement Okay, but after it's uh, undergo elimination, okay, the bromine here can remove with this hydrogen to form this double bond. And this bromine also can remove with this hydrogen and form the double bond here. So after that, these two products, okay, both is has one chiral center. So it will form four isomers because this one will form two this one will form another two so total is four which means uh, it's not going to be three isomers so E wrong okay for C uh, the elimination will uh, will be from this bromine and that's this hydrogen okay so then you form this product and this bromine also can remove with this hydrogen to form this product okay so both products also it has one chiral center here again huh? so here got one hydrogen okay another group here another group here another group here okay so it has one chiral center and another isomer also it has one chiral center here so total is four also not the answer for D the bromine can only removed with this hydrogen because in this carbon it has no hydrogen only this carbon has so the bromine will remove with this hydrogen and form this compound only and no chiral carbon so just one 
okay that's why answer confirm is A thank you